Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gregory Gage and this video is my one year, one year hair transplant update. So check it out. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gregory Gage and this video is going to be filmed over a long period of time. It's something that I've been very self-conscious about. It's good that I'm finally getting it done. An FUE hair transplant procedure and I'm very excited about it. This will be the starting point. So it's, I know some people will be like, it's not even that bad. But for me, it just, it goes up too high. But it has always, always, for as long as I can remember, been this shape. So I'm just getting it like straightened out. Not even like brought down very far, just straightening out this. Hopefully this goes well. Wish me luck on this journey and I will see you later. So I've had all the anesthetic. My head is numb. And now I'm gonna have all of the grass taken out. Okie dokie, so we're in like the implantation bit of the surgery and it's been anesthetized and I'm starting getting the, the little jabs to say to like put the holes in put the hair into. And yeah, it's going good. Can't feel a thing. This greenish look away. There you go. That is all done. <laughs> Thank you. And now all the hair is going to go back into my head. I'm excited. Okay, so we're all done. It looks good. It looks good. It'll obviously look a lot better when it's, when it's healed. It is swollen there at the top a little bit. It's very tight. I'm feeling good about this. You can see how, how I'm still quite puffy in my face. Like my cheeks are, are very full. But yeah, it's going good. It is going good. And this is week two. It is healing quite well and it's in there pretty good. So I, I, I should be able to start sleeping normally soon. Just over a month since I've had my procedure done, I will show you guys what my hair looks like right now. You can see I've I've lost loads of the hair shafts, but you can see there is still loads of bits where the hair is still there. I've actually got a few little bits where the hair has already started to grow into little baby hairs. There's some on this side that are a bit longer than the rest of them, and there's oh couple on this side that are quite long as well. This is month three of my hair transplant. I skipped out the second month one because not really a huge amount changed. I was in the dormant phase so not really much was going on with the with the hair growth um, but we are now just coming up to three months since I had the procedure done and there is change so you can see the difference right now which is great. I love it. I mean, it's going well. In this video, I am going to get PRP injections into my scalp. There we go, all done. It literally takes no time at all. It looks a bit bumpy there where it's all gone in, but that's that's just that will settle. But yeah, oh, a little bit stingy, but it's okay. It's fine. This is my four month update, but now that it is growing even more, I'm really excited about it because it's looking very good. Like you can, as I pull this up, you can see there's like loads of hair growth there. It is looking good. This is going to be my five month update. As you can see, it's pretty, pretty straight and it is growing through really, really well. It looks, to me, it looks really good. I'm very pleased with how it's looking. Um, it is quite a natural looking hairline, I would say. When it like, when I pull the hair back and you can like see where it's, it's actually growing and stuff, it looks really good. I do, I do like it and it kind of matches the um, the natural hairline at the sides of my of my face. This video is going to be my six month hair transplant update. Thickened up since last month. I, I'm very, very pleased with it. I think it looks great. It's still obviously got a ways to go, but you can see like as I 
pull my hair back it 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 does it looks quite obviously if you're looking at it really really close you're gonna tell that it's, it's a it's a hair transplant but from from here it just looks like a natural like a naturally straight hairline which is which is great it's pretty much exactly what i was looking for oh my god look at this my seven month fue hair transplant update one of the best things about this hair transplant is that it's filled in those gaps just there and there it's still a way to go with the thickness and everything, but it is doing really well for seven months down the line. This is gonna be my eight month hair transplant update video. So you're gonna see how this is all doing up here. I shaved the back of my head and you can hardly see a thing. You would not be able to tell that I've had a hair transplant or had any hair ripped out of the back of my head. FUE, that's why I went for FUE. There are pros and cons to both. So it's worth checking that out and having a look up what those pros and cons are before you decide on what you want to do. Um, there's also pros and cons to just getting a hair transplant done in the first place. I, I'm, I'm happier than I've ever been with my hair, so I'm very, very pleased. And you can, you, as, literally, as soon as I pull my hair up, you can see me smile. We're nine months in, and it's it's uh, there's still some growing left to go. Um, the hair does grow like it's 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 in place, so that if I were to put my hair up and mess my hair up. This side kind of goes out like that. This side kind of goes out like that. And then this bit goes up. It is looking good. I'm 10 months now down the line and it usually takes anywhere from a year to a year and a half to have like the full, full result. 11 month hair transplant update. It's continuing to improve every single month. It is getting better and better. It could be another seven months until I have the full, final results um, because it can take up to 18 months and a year and a half for you to really see the final final benefits of a hair transplant and then here we are at one year 12 months after getting my hair transplant done it has honestly changed my life it's made me so much more confident with just getting up washing my hair going out of the house without actually doing anything to my hair i haven't done anything to my hair today and i am fine with it um it's Oh, it just it makes me so happy just seeing this really nice straight hairline um, I know it's not for everyone, but for me it's exactly what I wanted so That's all that really really matters um, if you're getting a hair transplant or if you're getting any kind of surgery It's it the only thing that matters is what you want and how you like how you feel about it after you've had it done and making sure that you you get what you wanted to get This is what I wanted to get and this is what I've got and I couldn't be happier with it, to be honest. It's it's definitely, definitely given me the confidence boost that I've always wanted. I don't mind windy days. I don't mind <laughs> stormy days. I don't mind my hair getting wet in the rain. It's 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 honestly been the biggest thing I've ever done for myself, and it's the best thing I've ever done for myself. I'm so pleased with it. And um, yeah, really, really couldn't be happier. For anyone that wants to know, I'm currently taking finasteride, one milligram a day. Some days I do miss it. So it's, 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 it's most days, but every, every now and then I kind of just forget to take one. So yeah, that's that sort of medication situation. And for me, I've not noticed any side effects. I know a lot of guys are worried about the side effects, but I have had no side effects. I am still good to go in all the ways you want to be good to go in. I have definitely noticed that I don't see any hair falling out when I'm like having a shower or when I'm brushing my hair or doing my hair. Um, when I do do my hair, in that sense, I guess it is definitely, definitely working. But yeah, oh God, just look at it. It just, it makes me so happy. This is just like, it's a nice full hairline. It's good. It's, oh, it's really good. I do need a haircut right now. My hair is getting a bit too long and we are in very, very hot weather at the moment. It looks like a mess now. Uh, we're in really hot weather at the moment, so it is absolutely baking having all of this hair on my head. Quick one about the scarring. I've not had any, any visible scarring at the back of my head. You can't really see anything. Um, I do need to get this cut though. It is far too long at the back. So yeah, I'm sure if I got it cut really short, you might be able to see something, but I don't know, I can't. <laughs> I, I can't see anything and when I've had it cut pretty short before I've not noticed any visible scarring either So um, that's why I went for FUE. I think that's about it. So let's just take a look at the last 12 months in a time-lapse
that is that. Um, remember guys, if you do want to get your hair transplant done and you decide that you want to get it done at Vinci Hair Clinic on London's Harley Street, which is where I got mine done, um, feel free to use my code. It will get you a free three month supply of Vitruvian hair vitamin supplements, which is uh, Vinci Hair Clinic's own formulated formula of, of vitamins and um, it's got hair boosting vitamins and things in it that are, are good to help your hair grow. So if you're going to get your hair transplant done at Vinci anyway, just use the code and you'll get those for free. So the code is in the description down below and it's also along the screen here, GGVV2021. If you're on a hair transplant journey right now, let me know in the comments down below. I love to read all of the comments. Um, if you have any questions at all, feel free to drop them in the comments. I will get back to you. Um, or send me a message on Instagram. I'm more than happy to get back to you on Instagram as well. Um, it is going to take me a while to get through because there's quite a few questions that I still need to answer on there. But I will, will, will get to you. Um, that is pretty much it for this video. If you did enjoy it, please do give me a big thumbs up. And yeah, I will see you next month for another update. 13 months. Let's go. <laughs> right, thanks for watching guys. Bye.